One more step and I'll put a bolt through your eye! No sudden movements or you're dead. You looking for me? Hurt or not, I won't miss. Lung, heart, arse, or eye. Take your pick. Tell me what you're doing here. Now. Cute. I've scraped more frightening things than you off my boot. Either piss off or show me what you're made of. Could have sworn I told you to piss off. Maybe I imagined it. Anyhow, piss off. <laughs> and you believe them? Those bastards are trying to feed you a crock of shit. Don't sweat it. The devils are tricky fuckers. They can't breathe without lying. I guess they told you I'd bite the heads off babies and paint myself in their blood. Truth's not quite so exciting. Come on over and I'll tell you the whole story. I'm a fugitive. Escaped from the hells. And those bastards are trying to take me back. Find this funny as she winces agony shoots through you as if your bodies shared the same wound then you're lost in visions of demonic armies as you tear through a landscape of fire and blood the blood war you saw it from above as the nautiloid passed through avernus this woman was on the front line Stalker! what was that you're inside my head. Hold on a minute. You were on that ship. With the tentacles and the and the worms. I didn't think anyone else had survived. I boarded in Avernus. That ship was my way out. You're lucky I did. The place would have been crawling with cultists if I'd stuck around. And they'd have dragged us all back to Avernus. I was a prisoner, forced to fight in the Blood War. The eternal battle between bad and worse. Most souls in Avernus are just meat for the grinder, but not me. I held my own. More than. Turns out that I've got a knack for killing demons. <laughs> and I enjoy it. And that made me a valuable asset. Devils don't like to lose their assets. Yeah. Can you handle it? You get a friend who spat in Baphomet's eye and lived to tell the tale. Oh. Fuck yes! Oh. They cornered me in the toll house just up the hill. Doubt they've gone far after the beating I gave them. I come with you just to see them bleed, but I'm too busy bleeding myself. I'll be here when you're done.
Did you get the bastards? <laughs> you can try, but if you do cut me down, I'll see you in the hells one day and return the favor. Count on it. Corpse is covered in tattoos and scars. Powerful infernal wards native to Avernus. Some are inked onto her skin, others written in scars. The head comes free with a sickening crunch. Thank you. As promised, here is my blade. Blessed by Tyr. It's sacred. The most valuable thing I've ever held. I hope it serves you as well as it served me. Did you get the bastards? For now, but thank you. Her mind touches yours. Gratitude, warmth, and relief. Then, a light, sharper than the truest blade, brighter than a star, 
It fills you with awe, forcing you to your knees. And from within, a winged figure steps forward, graceful and terrible. She places her hand on your cheek and smiles as she carves her name across your chest. Kua ad vosnam Petrica. Zariel, fallen lady, defiled celestial, ruler of Avernus. I was her prisoner and her champion. She tried to break me. The paladins you killed were acting on her orders. She'll send more and worse. Oh, I'm counting on it. I'll be ready for her. And the first step is to go home, to Baldur's Gate. I've got a score to settle. I could use the company, but until I've shaken Zariel off my back, I'd only put a target on yours. My advice, stay away from the city. When I catch up with the fuckers who did this to me, the streets will run red. Thank you. 